But Wanda rules. Very nice lady. Wanda she is. Wanda. She's the best. You know that guy back there, too. What's happening? <laughs> All right. I've got your picture on my computer. Is he? Really? Oh, come in and talk to him. Come in and talk to him. Come in and talk to him. the camera here. Oh, come on. Don't be shy. Get out. What's okay. Angie. Hi, Angie. Angie. How are you today? Okay, I guess. You have her picture on your computer? Yes. Where'd you get it? Plantation, Florida. Yeah, we were there in Plantation. Yes. We right. Oh, my God. A picture where somebody's got their hands around my neck trying to kill me. Is that right? I've got all the pictures. Ken Faree told me as long as I emailed him the pictures, I could take his picture. He ripped that off of me. I am the only one that does the official stranglehold like this, no, this around the neck. Sorry. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. Mine's cooler. Yeah. No, nah, mine, mine's cooler. Mine's much cooler. <laughs> yes, it is. You look creepy. We have a dawn. Uh, I, I can look creepy. <laughs> <laughs> so can I. We have a dawn. We have a dawn of dead room over in the uh, convention. convention center. Yeah. And it's going to be a great show. Spooky Empire puts on the best show ever in yeah, the whole do. world. Yes, I mean, they do. That's Pete Mongelli, the president of Spooky Empire. Exactly. Right. I mean, and his staff and his crew and everybody's just fantastic. We love coming down here to Florida. And like Clayton said, we're going to be in a room just dawn of the dead. And we're all going to be in there signing autographs and talking to the fans. Maybe you know us from Hellraiser 3, too. We're in Hellraiser, you know that? That's right. Now my wife told me. That. I, I played a priest in Hellraiser 3. She plays a. I'm a blonde nurse in Hellraiser yeah, we 3. Did the casting for. We did the location casting for Hellraiser 3. Very cool. My wife's the one that pointed it out. Kathy, my wife said, she goes, they're, they're also in Hellraiser. Oh, yeah. And I said, oh, cool, because she's a big Hellraiser fan. Oh, cool. So very cool. Oh, nice. Tell her to come over and talk to us. Oh, we, well, she will. She'll be there. We were with Doug Bradley last weekend at uh, West Ever Mass. Oh, very cool. Very cool. Yeah, I met Doug Bradley in 2004, too, in Fort Lauderdale Scream Fest. Yeah, yeah. Well, all right. Anything you want to hey, give us? Give us a plug for uh, Wine Coop TV here. Hello, how are you? What is the name of the TV? It's here? called Wine Coop TV. Wine Coop TV is the best station I've ever watched in my life in Florida. You guys got to all tune in soon. <laughs> Me too. Oh. <laughs> all right. Thanks a lot, y'all. Great job. Great job. All right. Well. <laughs> Once again, I think we just heard that Mike Christopher disappeared back over to the hotel just as I was picking up the microphone. He left. We'll catch him later, though. We'll see him later on. Um, I guess if the camera wants to take one more swing around, we'll get a big panoramic shot of everything that's going on here. Hey, Ash. Ash. Can we get a word with you? We got Ash from Evil Dead coming over. See, sometimes this happens on Wine Coop TV. We'll just be standing around in a parking lot, and a temporal void will open up. Uh, some would call it a time warp, time dimension, vortex, break in the uh, solidia field of um, uh, psychopathic, psychotronic, uh, crack, time disbursement, and Ash just dropped through. How you doing, Ash? Fantastic. Now, you are the real Ash from the real Evil Dead. That's me, baby. Because you know, you know the, you're the real one, but Bruce Campbell is just the guy that acted out your part. Yeah, he plays me. So you, the story was all real. That's what I heard. Yeah, mo for the most part. You know, uh, more girls, uh, lots more undead. And, uh, yeah. So more than, than the movie showed you killing all those uh, zombies, there was a lot more in, in the real life because you're, you're the real Ash. Absolutely. I mean, absolute real Ash. They had yeah. to tone it down because it was too much for most people. They had to take it and re-edit it a few times, but yeah. So you, you, you heard a lot of zombies, huh? Yeah. yeah. Killed them dead? Yeah, killed them dead. Well, when you're, when you're not zombie hunting, do you watch Wine Coop TV? No. Yeah, you say, uh, do, we'll say that again. Do you watch Wine Coop TV? Absolutely. All right, that's the answer we're looking for. Tell them this is Ash from Wine Coop TV. This is Ash from Wine Coop's TV. All right, cool. We got Ash. Now you're gonna you're gonna hang around. Is the portal gonna swallow you up? You think you'll hang around here for a while and lead the zombie march? Uh, it depends on the babes. Then then I might go back in the tie warp. You know. Yeah. It depends. Because uh, what did, what did, what did you? Oh, it wasn't. It was uh, Bruce Campbell said it, but you said it originally. It was it was a uh, uh, gr groovy baby. Groovy. Yeah, that's it. All right. All right, that's Ash. Ash, thank you very much, man. Thank you. All right, so you can see a lot of stuff going on here. We got Ash, we had that Zed, and uh, we got a lot of zombies. Wow, look at all the cameras going on around here. Here's camera two over here. Come here, camera two. You want to be on camera? All right, introduce yourself to the Wine Coop TV audience. Hi, I'm Jennifer Geiger, and I'm doing camera two. <laughs> all right, she's going to be taking my place in about five minutes when I run back to get a shower and head to my table and stuff like that. So, Is there another car coming? Here comes the car. Just one second. He wants our attention. 
participate in the game. I think this is where uh, Joel Weinkup's going to sign off. Great. Hey, one more thing before Joel Weinkup disappears back to his hotel room to get a shower because it's so dang hot here in Tampa. I'm sorry. We're in Orlando. It's hot here, too. Here's my friend Renee, Renee yes. from Shriek Freak Quarterly, right? Right. And she just did an interview with my good friend, Andrew Dean Vanskoy. How are you doing today? Good. Real good. You looking forward to all this craziness? You're all you're all set to go. Oh, we're all set to go. Yeah. All right. Taking cool. lots of pictures for the magazine and uh, look for issue two. We'll have an interview with Joel here. With who? With you. With me. With you. I'm gonna be in Shriek Freak Freak, Freak. Quarterly, <laughs> the second issue. Very very cool. So you're looking. Hot. Is it? It's hot out here, huh? It's very hot. But now, after you get this, you're going to be over there in the convention center and, yeah. and walking around Spooky Empire and everything, right? That's right. All right. Tell everybody what show they're watching. Wine Coop TV. <laughs> all right. It only took a little prodding. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> hey, thanks a lot, Renee. We're going to see you around. All right. All right. Take care. <laughs> hey, Wine Coop TV. We're here at Spooky Empire 2008. Look at this crowd. Look at down here. Down here. Other way. Damn it. Down there. There we go. And down. And screw head. No, I don't know what. <laughs> Yo, you've got to see this. You've got to see this guy. He made his own. Look at this. is cool. This almost looks like Marcus. I saw you last year. You made it to our ScreenFest 2000 video on YouTube. You're in there. He's cool. Look at it. Who is this? Who is this? What's your name? Mike. Mike. Monster Mike. And we got over here. Oh, oh Scott. This, oh, my gosh. Do you know who this is? Do you know who this is? Baron Christian from Star Trek VI. Can you believe it? He is here in the flesh. Baron, how you doing? Hey, it's good to see you. It's good to see you, man. man What's going I've, on? I've been seeing you a lot on TV, man. Seen you a lot on TV, huh? You're going to be famous. Yeah, man. Not, no. No, I know. I know. I hate myself. So how you doing, man? Pretty good. We worked together in... Uh that Christian Day movie. Oh, yeah. Uh, Body in a Dumpster? Trash Box Theater. Yeah, Body in a Dumpster. Oh, the line's moving. Along a little bit the, here. the line's moving along. Yeah. You have another movie uh, lined up? I have smoke lined up. Yeah, you, you have to tell us about that. Oh, I play, I play a corrupt, perverted congressman. You can do that. Well, you don't even have to try. Thanks. Just walk in, and they'll just shoot you, and they'll go, that was good, and here's your money, go home. Yeah. <laughs> it was nice to have seen you. 